I've got again um, somebody I, I really enjoy interviewing on a, a regular basis, uh, Kevin Barry. So, um, kind of, I suppose, best place to start is, um, what's the update on the Joseph Parker-Anthony Joshua negotiations? Well, I'll tell you what, you know, we have, you know, we've been doing everything in our power to make this fight. Yeah, well, you know, I know I've been talking to you over the last couple of years and um, you guys have been, you know, set on your goal of, of winning a world title and Anthony Joshua has always been mentioned ever since we started speaking. Um, by the sounds of things, that goal is fast becoming a reality. Um, what update can you give us on the negotiations to, to get this fight made? Well, I'll tell you what, mate. Um, as soon as any turn that Joshua called Joseph out after the pack of fights, you know, Joseph Martin came into our team and said, look, mate, make that fight. He said, I like what I saw in the pack of fights. He said, you know, now is the time for us to fight and make that fight. So once we had, once we had that support, I've been looking at Joshua for a long time. When you when you just mentioned forward, you know, we've been talking about this fight for the last, God, the last two and a half years, before both guys were, were ever world champions. Yeah. Um, and, and, and in those days, you know, the, the, the money would have been greatly different and the business would have been greatly different from what it is today. Um, uh, you know, but he, here we are in uh, two, you know, December 2017 talking about a fight first up in 2018 and we have, you know, we've really done everything in our power to try and make this fight a reality. You know, we've, uh, we've made some serious concessions. We've stepped up. We've, uh, we've built Joseph Parker's profile in the UK up. We have, um, you know, we want to make this fight. The person at the moment uh, uh, who's holding this fight back is Anthony Joshua, I believe. I, I believe he's made the decisions. Uh, like the whole thing is, you know, right from the get go, we know that Joshua's got two belts. We know we're going to the UK. Um, uh, but, you know, unification is, is, is a pretty big deal. I mean, we haven't had one for, you know, for, for six odd years. So, you know, we want to make sure that, uh, that the business side of things is not all one sided. So we sat down as a team right from the get go. So basically, um, to kind of sum that up, we're, we're edging closer to a deal. Um, it's just a sort of final final bit of negotiating, really. Is that, is that kind of where we are? Well, I'll tell you what, we're, we're sort of, uh, we're very close, we're very close at the moment. As I mentioned, we've made concessions. I think now it's up to Anthony Joshua. If he really wants this unification fight, and if he really wants to be true to the fans like he says he is, We'll move those couple of those couple of percentages, and this fight will happen. Um, but you know, like, you know, we're, we're 
not going to be held over the barrel by Eddie Hearn or Anthony Joshua. You know, there are other fights out there that, you know, we're obviously, you know, we've put a lot of energy into this in the last three to four weeks. But, you know, we have other offers on the table. And if they want a unification fight, then let's get the business done and we will be there. And, and I'll tell you what, um, you know, Joseph Parker is very, very live in this fight with Anthony Joshua, mate. I, the, the more times I look at it, he's got, as I mentioned before, he's got a better resume. Both guys are undefeated. Parker has better movement. He has faster hands. I know he has better skill than Joshua. And we definitely know he has a better chin. There is no doubt about that. Okay. You know, there, are two, there are two things that when you look at heavyweight boxing, mate, there are, two, there are two things that I know to be true. You know, in heavyweight boxing, you have to be able to give a punch. Um, and you have to be able to take a punch. And I know that both Joshua and Joseph Parker can deliver a punch. But I also know that Joseph Parker, mate, has never been down as, as an amateur. He's never been down as a pro. He's never been down in hundreds and hundreds of professional sparring rounds. I can't say the same for Anthony Joshua. 